Welcome back to my channel. My name is Audrey. I'm 19 years old and I am on the autistic spectrum. So in today's video we are doing quarantine week 21. So Friday was a nice day. I had my swim coaching session and I practiced my butterfly and but it's all their stuff. It's swimming is getting really hard which I'm excited about. So that'll be fun. And then Saturday okay Rosie Saturday turned out to be started out to be a normal day I got up got ready um, to swim and then I walked boomer had some lunch um, went swimming invited my sister to swim with me so me and my sister swam for hours and then I got home to walk this little girl and she was in pain um, I'm gonna do like a whole update on what happened if you follow me on TikTok um, you already knew about this, so if you do not follow me on TikTok, go follow me on there, and you can scroll down, and there'll be um, some videos of um, the day that Rosie went to the animal ER when I took her. Um, I'm going to vlog tomorrow. She's going to her doctor, who um, did a surgery for her um, last year to get some updates on what happened so if you want to know why that is go to my tiktok and follow me at audrey at all about audrey seven and scroll down and watch those videos about rosie going to the animal er so yeah when i got home from the er for her, for her I had to set up her crate and all that stuff and had to like pick up lunch, get some pill pockets for her, all this stuff. So it ended up being pretty late. So Sunday, I woke up again. I still kind of relax on Sunday mornings. I don't like to necessarily like sleep in, but I also don't like to like get up when I wake up. So I like wake up at a normal time, but I relax in bed with Rosie for a few hours. So I got up, got dressed, and got ready to swim, walked boomer, um, but it was weird because when I got up to walk, I had, I, I was supposed to go to the grocery store the day before, so I had no food, but instead I had to go to the ER to take Rosie, so I had no food, so I had to, like, Postmate or something, um, breakfast, and it took hours, and after the hours went by, they canceled the order, so I was hours away from, so it was like already like 2 p.m., haven't eaten at all, so I just ate a bar, and I went out to lunch, um, and I ran my errands that I was supposed to run, some of them, I forgot something I needed to return, so I went to, um, Trader Joe's in a local grocery store, and that was nice, so Monday was, um, a good day. I got up, got ready, um, talked to my mom about all the things um, we need to talk about. I ordered um, Rosie's stairs. We are organizing. Um, Rosie's getting a trainer. I don't know if I've talked about it, but um, we're like scheduling that. So I'll do a whole video about Rosie's training. And even if you guys want, I can even do a series and like tell you guys weekly updates about it in some way instead of doing like quarantine updates and just kind of talk about my week briefly if you guys want so comment down below if you guys want that um and i ordered a couch because i ordered a new couch my mom did for me and they got lost so they um refunded it so i ended up ordering the same couch off amazon my mom did so that's coming. It's coming the 20th, and I think when you guys see this, it will maybe already been here if it came on time, if you know what I mean. Um, so that was nice, and just had a nice relaxing day with my doggy. Um, so that was really nice. It was just really nice. So, And then Tuesday, I got up. Well, I overslept, but luckily for me, I've been having such trouble sleeping so tonight, I'm taking away my devices for myself at 9 p.m. If I don't, and I tell you guys, next Friday, I'm in trouble. Or you might even know tomorrow because I'm going to vlog. So you'll see, to, you'll see on Tuesday, not Friday. So make sure you turn into next week's video to find out, did I take away my phone or not for myself? That's part of living on your own. you got to be uh, diligent for yourself and your... One, because you don't have your mom to take away your phone for you, so you got to do it yourself. Um, yeah. 
And so I'm going to do that. So luckily the pool was closed. And so I ended up just having a nice relaxing day. Went out, got some stuff done. What did I actually went out? What did I do? I know I spent some time at my mom's. Maybe I talked. Oh, yeah. I went, um, yes, this is what I did. I went to the chiropractor. That was really nice. I went um, to T-Mobile. My, my phone is broken. Um, they did a soft reset. So that happened. And I need a new screen protector, if you can see. I think there's a bubble right here. Um, so, yeah. So I need to go like get a screen protector. Apparently, they're um, back in stock today for my phone. So that was just a really nice day. And then Wednesday, which was yesterday, I had such a fun time. Even though um, I got up, got dressed, walked a dog, um, had some... And then I went out. I really just wanted some mom and daughter time. So my mom took me to Chick-fil-A and um, Starbucks. And I was so excited. I went to Marshall's. I did like a whole like stim dance. I was just so excited to go because I haven't gone in like months. And I love going to Marshall's. And my, that's something my mom and I will do sometimes to like look at home decor and stuff. So that was nice. And I went shopping, and if you didn't watch Tuesday's video, you should go watch the haul to see what I got at Marshall's. So go do that right now. Well, actually, wait until this video is over. So it was just really nice. So then I went home, walked, relaxed, and had a popsicle, and it was just a nice relaxing evening. I couldn't sleep, so I ended up oversleeping my swim lesson. I've had such trouble. Um, so that's why I'm taking away my phone because I didn't wake up. I like I woke up at 11 and I just felt really bad for oversleeping. So I'm like, you know, let me spend like 30 minutes having a pity party for myself and then feel better. That pitted out pity hour ended up pitting pity party didn't end up ending until 1 p.m. So I might have slept. So sometimes you need to have a pity party and then move on. That's okay. So I hope you guys have a good rest of your day. I love y'all so much. Thank you guys for watching this video. I know it was all over the place. I'm having some troubles with my phone, so it's been hard to like write my notes for my videos. So thank you for being understanding. If you made it all the way through, comment a yellow heart emoji, me, emoji and tell me your favorite food in the comments below. Bye, guys.